Hello and welcome back everyone to a new episode of our Let's Try Middle Earth Shadows of War uh, Let's Play series or Let's Try series. Um, in the last episode we did some preparational work for assassinating Zafra the Heartless, a war chief, orc war chief here. And now we're just jumping right in to um, kill him. As always, my name's Sneaky Bard. And there we go, we have Zafra over there. Oh, apparently we managed to kill Crimp of the White Hand by burning him. Way to go, Baronor. Do we actually need to do anything at all? We could probably just kill these guys on our own. Oh dear. Let's let's intercept that god captain there. Oh, he's just getting burned him by himself. Attract you. Come here. Oh no. Well, Let's see. We could probably let Barano do all the work, but that sounds a bit cheating. Like cheating, so... Where are you, War Chief? There, stealth kill. Beastmaster. There we go. Let's kill you. Okay, we kill the War Chief. Okay. There's Zathra. Yes, something like that. The blood of man swine will flow into my belly today. Hopefully I'll not. Take yours first. Okay. We are next to a cave troll, which uh, I do hate as opponents. Let's just stealth kill you, or at least deal lots of damage to you. Nice that the Gondorians are taking care of the new enemy savages. Savages counter normal attacks from the front. Press B to stun them before attacking or strike them from behind. Alright. Alright. Is he a savage then? Okay, let's do our execution here because we do have enough... Wait, what? Are we getting killed? Nice! Baronor came to save us. I don't know if that was because we actually did anything. <laughs> but yeah, we totally agree with Baronor there. Let's unlock a skill while we're at it before we die again. So we did have this here. That we wanted the raft chain. Uh, so let's go and do unlock that. Not that it's very good for us in this fight particularly, but yeah, okay. Alright. Oh dear. Oh dear. Do we have regular... Let's get the Karago out. Oh no, are we dying? Damn it. Okay, he's not letting us die, or is it Calabrimbo who's saving us? Even with the Gondorians in Oh no, we failed the mission. Well, let's go and succeed at it this time. We got quite far. Not far enough though. So yeah, here we go. Can't skip that, sorry. Nothing is sweeter. But yeah, Together, we are definitely uh, running up against my skillless. Uh, oh. How do you call it? I'm not very skilled. Ah, uh, I can slash. There we go. Good Barano. Let's go. Okay. He died again, as last time. Maybe he scripted to die like that, no idea. Let's see. Okay, we didn't quite manage to hit that war chief. Okay, there we go. He's a savage, I think. The blood of man swine will flow into my belly today. Well, let's see if we can't do something about it this time, because last time you did kill us after all. Can be killed instantly using poison. Okay. 
Vulnerable to stealth. Ah, so we need to go to stealth then. Let's jump up here. Let's go here. And see if we can't get some beasts out. Right here. And shoot. Ah, that was one one bad shot there. Ouch. Uh, let's run. No, I prefer not to be on my knees. I also prefer not to die. Let's... Okay, we apparently cannot uh, drain you. Let's see, okay, our um, execution. Oh dear. Ah, there, we missed it again, but thankfully, Barino is there to save us, as last time. You're not out of the fight yet, Ranger. Thank you. Did we get now enough to level? Oh no. I, oh, we, we didn't lose our XP from last time, which is nice. He's not arrow proof that much. I do remember we can actually shoot him. And unless we miss him like we do now. Fireproof. Fireproof. Okay. Shag. What a name for an orc. Burn to death. So okay, let's let's use our stealth here. Here we got a Gondorian sword. Let's use the fact that our target is vulnerable to stealth to actually try and kill him. Oh dear. Oh dear, ouch. He did hit us. Let's let's go back somewhere. Probably the Gondorians can take care of him for us. And we can actually probably... No, we can't drain this guy. He's... Oh, that's a Gondorian. Would explain why we can't drain him. Oh, Irino is getting beaten as well. Don't we have any other orcs around here that we could drain? Hold on, Barino. You don't get to die just yet. The Gondorians are making short work of him. Well, there's more arrows here. Yes, I know that we should drain orcs to regain health, but we don't have any orcs. Apart from that guy. There we go. We can't drain him quite. There we go. Oh dear. Oh, he died. Nice. Barino once again with the killing blow. And the Gondorian archers, obviously, who I'd did the brunt work. A good hunt. Less so for the war chief. And these archers. We should go hunting again. <laughs> it would be my pleasure. Indeed, because we seem to be unable to kill the <laughs> war chiefs on our own. So, Tal. Did we make a difference? <laughs> bitter, bitter, Calabrimbo. We cannot see your lens. We must return to Shilop. Again? The only reason to go back is for my ring. Enough! Our ring. <laughs> this is about more than your ring. Or you! Her sight may be what saves us all. I'm not sure about that. She definitely works for her own end. Poor trusting Talion. But well, hey, at least we managed to do that quest. Things could be worse. And we leveled again. Nice. Alright, let's give ourselves the skill point. What do we want here? Deadly Spectre. We have all sorts of nice skills that we could get here. Stealth kills can be used against beasts, but we need to be level 10 for that. We're only level 9. Uh, yeah, level 14. Bursting toxin. No. 
uh, ground finishers that go quicker. Reprisal. Okay, that might be actually interesting. Uh, gain might for each kill while you remain undetected. Hmm, interesting. Spectral dash, no. Unyielding ferocity. No, not that interested in that either. Just because um, we we don't use brutalize that much. And bursting toxin, not interested in that either. Deadly spectre could be useful. But I think this is the point where I actually go and try and get something like um, Brace of Daggers. Unless there's something here which really, really interests me. I mean, that, that's a good one. As is this, I mean... Uh, Fury? What's Fury? Okay, could be interesting. Uh, brutal aggression. Mm, I'm going for the Brace of Daggers just because it gives us one other way of uh, using ranged attacks, which seem to be nice at this difficulty, at least for our playstyle. You trust her too easily. I can't agree. ignore what she has shown me. All right. Come on, Talion. Let's jump. And off we go. Running. Come on. Let's jump. No. You didn't. I mean, we bumped into one of you. But that's about it. I do love this double jump though, even though it lets us traverse the the bird, or the higher up rooftop plane a bit too easily maybe. Because in more skilled hands I can see people doing more things than me with it. But anyway, here we are, Tra Traitor's Gate. Minas Ethel is on the edge of the defeat. Shilop may be able to provide help, but at what cost? So let's go and talk to her. I have come to see more. I know. <laughs> if you can see Sauron's fate, tell us his weakness. So we may defeat him. Ah, yeah, good try, Kelebrimbo, but I don't think she wants Your to make things limited. easy for us. I would love nothing more than to see his torment. Oh, really? To see him beg before me. <laughs> My gaze is fixed upon the fate of Middle-earth. Return what you have stolen from me, and I will bring Sauron to you in chains. <laughs> Interesting. Why would I do that, Ringmaker? You and Sauron are one. Oh. Is this what you seek? Vagaries and riddles? She is not our ally. Certainly not yours. Come, Talia. See through my eyes, see through my eyes. Oh, she's the opposite of Gollum in this case. Gollum is more curious about um, the Brightmaster, Celebrimbo. Whereas Shilob is much more our ally. But yeah, someone's apparently going to betray Minas Ethel. Minas Ethel House is a traitor. How is this possible? <laughs> Do you doubt her? Her visions have come to pass. So far. You and I have both seen it. And Venus Ethel is fighting a war on two sides. Alright. Let's go and find out who our traitor is. Oh, there is our favorite sidekick, Gollum. Take us to him. Our war chief speaks to him through a messenger. <laughs> we can show you the messenger. Ah. Look there. Do you see? The 
dark mistress offers her little ones <laughs> a nest filled with her children. Okay. So what do the spiders do exactly? Colin, they're going cat. Too close to these orcs. Okay. Gollum apparently can go right into orcs without alerting them. I doubt that we can do that. But let's have the spiders do the work for us here. And stealth kill this guy. And let's hold out our glaive. There we go. And they'll ground execute you. Oh, come on. And let's still. Okay, apparently we are not going to stealth train you, but I would like to execute you. There. Nice. I guess this is what Gollum wanted. We gave them a bit deeper of a sleep. Oh, there we go. Alright, we'll follow the messenger for a bit. Stay out of sight, Gollum. As always. Let's stealth brand you so that we get some health back and then kill you. And we need to avoid detection here. Let's jump up here as Spider Ranger. Alright, and here. Let's see, are there archers up here? Yes, one. And stealth kill you. Alright. This seems to have much more stealth missions, which I do do enjoy. Compared to Compared to the first game. Sorry, I was getting distracted by that captain coming up. Okay. Apparently he is quite the Oh, Pug the Assassin. This is the guy we killed. And he has his nasty poison blade. Let's hit you. There we go. There. there we go. Use our execution thing. Leaving missionary apparently. Well, we will have to get uh, back to the mission later unless unless uh, retrying it. Wait, if we retry, what happens? Apparently, you don't get to kill the captain. Anyway, let's retry the mission then. Um, but that's stuff for the next episode because my alarm is about to go off here and I did uh, set it running a bit later. So, as always, my name's been Sneaky Bard and you've been absolutely awesome. If you're enjoying these, I'll be rambling, but uh, blind uh, Let's Try series of Shadows of Mordor, then do give me a like, do give me a subscribe. Also, just in case you have any feedback on how to do, say, the coup de gras, the last chance, I think they call them, events better, just put that down in the comments as well, always. Happy to learn how to be better at the hack and slash genre. Uh, otherwise, just share the word as well with your friends, with your colleagues. If they're interested about Shadow of War but haven't purchased it yet, let's just see how many people we can get to watch this. I mean, I hope you're enjoying it. I'm definitely enjoying the game, so I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.